And now to a special graduation ceremony at San Quentin Rehabilitation Center this week. 50 graduates got their diplomas in a wide range of skills from construction to coding. Crown Force Ellis Ogamonian reports. Eric Bergen! Well, I've been in prison for almost 36 years. Uh, I've never been on a computer until I started the class, so I had to learn how to use a computer and then learn how to code into the computer. So it was really challenging. Eric Bergen is at the San Quentin Rehabilitation Center getting his certificate of completion for web development fundamentals. He learned how to code while incarcerated without using internet. It was possible through a program called Code 7370 in partnership with nonprofit The Last Mile and the California Prison Industry Authority. Bergen says it's boosted camaraderie inside prison walls while bringing families together for a celebration. Beyond words. It's been a while since I've seen uh, my brothers together like this, and to have them here uh, supporting me, it's just amazing. About 50 people graduated on Thursday. Many of them from the coding class credit their dedicated instructors, like John Gripshover, who has been teaching here for a decade. It's important to me because I think what we're trying to do uh, has, has a larger purpose than, than teaching a vocation. I think what we're trying to do here is uh, not just educate, of course educate, and of course help find a profession, but find ourselves as well. He watched as a student from his first class took the stage as a successful software engineer for Checker. Chris Schumacher has turned his life around after serving 17 years. I encourage you all to continue to prepare yourselves as you have here today for life after prison. Because Bergen explains an investment in education for the incarcerated is an investment in the safety of our communities. And recognizing that the changes are necessary to make communities safer because it begins with us. If we become safe people, then we be, when we return to the society, societies that much safer. AUC Irvine study found that since the start of these programs here, 85% of graduates who were released did not go back to prison. Reporting in San Quentin, I'm Ella Sigamonian, Cron 4 News.